What's that? What's that song that starts with blue? Blue song. No, I, I meant I meant the song. Song gone. Something about dust. Dust in the wind. There you go. Dit is scheren. Een mesje, nog een mesje, veel mesjes, scherpe mesjes, mesjes hier, mesjes. Am I in focus? The compiled that makes the that. Bye bye. Get our navy on the go here. What, the Commonwealth entered into a coalition? Holy shit. Force rate at 9-11. Yeah, you're right there. Rip the urn. Oh man, I've beaten the Commonwealth but last night. Like I took the crime the Crimea off of them. It was a long and bloody war, but we won. It was just some steady progression, you know. It was them attacking us and us just throwing horses at them until they drowned in horse blood. That, uh, it's basically our, uh, our military, uh, guidebook. It's like, keep throwing horses at them until they drown. Now, th that shouldn't be necessary, because- oh, shit. That shouldn't be necessary anymore. Because, you know, horse, uh, hordes actually get new units now. But we're trying to emulate that same feel by not taking up military past Tech 16. Something tells me we're about to kill a whole bunch of ships. Oh yeah. So now I suppose we should uh, get some kind of army on uh, on Brunei land. Now 
you know, on the other hand, I'd much rather first uh, take care of Malak here, because he does have 70k. Oh, this is gonna hurt. That's not gonna hurt as bad as I hoped it would. And we're not quite done yet. Well, never mind. It's like it didn't even need to do the stack wipe, uh, the special trick to stack wipe those. That's uh, a bit anticlimactic. Won't get a lot of stack wipes here because this is all jungle, right? So.
I might stack wipe the navy though. Doubt it. No, oh, well, what do you know? Oh no, we didn't. We didn't kill it completely. Killed most of it there. Okey dokey. Man, this colonizing shit in um in Alaska's really bogging me down. Like I suck at colonizing, dude. Even though I've had exploration from the start. Like this is all I've colonized. Like some stuff up here. This and that. And that's it. And in fact, that was my first idea group. Oh. We're fucking almost there, dude. Holy shit. Almost to Tech 22. Oh. That's gonna be good. Alright, whilst doing that three mounts is achievement bug, I've noticed that there is a province that is uncored, so I need to core it for the glitch to work, right? What? No? No you don't? No, you just, uh... In a normal game, integrate everything, and then you'll have cores on that, so integrate main. And then you make a custom nation in the normal save file and then you select your Iron Man save file and it'll copy paste that but it everything that you copy paste is not going to be cored so you'll have 14,000 over extension but that's okay because for the three mountains you only need to own the world you don't need to actually core it so you'll get the achievement inst instantly Oh, you mean, like, you get an uncored prop? No, I don't think that matters. It shouldn't matter. It shouldn't make too much of a difference. My guys suck at fighting in jungle. That's sad. Yeah, the success of the Reformation is mostly uh, RNG. Yeah, I mean, you could help spread it around, of course. But... AI does what AI does. How many achievements do I have? Uh, I got uh, 106 out of 170. I don't have a lot of the uh, easy ones though, I kind of skipped those. 
From the hard ones, I still need to get Norwegian wood and uh, that Nagur thing. The Rajput Reich. And all the others have pretty much gotten. Twenty two twenty two eleven two thousand fifteen never forget people. Got the full playthrough on my YouTube. If you wanna go check that out, that's fine. Alright, M1 Faith, yeah. Still need to do that one. But I'm reserving that one to do it as a Jew. And don't worry, we won't be using that custom nations bug for that. Oh well we could technically make everything Jewish in a different save file and then transfer that over using the custom nations bug. But we're not doing that. No sir, we are not. I'm gonna play as the Ottomans though, but in the only acceptable way to play the Ottomans, which is make them Jewish. Because we are not Scrub Lord McGregory and we are just going to fucking uh, do one faith as a Jew, goddammit. That's gonna be harder than three mountains, so you can look forward to that. Although maybe as the Ottomans it won't be that much harder than three mountains. But doing it as Caraman was definitely harder than three mountains. Even though Caraman has that beautiful flag, so... Uh -huh. You explain how to do the three mountains with this bug, yes! Uh, I'll upload a video uh, today on my YouTube that uh, is going to explain everything. Also, Constitution. So now we get defensive ideas. And after we finish that, we can get that thingy. And then we should be able to build a 1,000 stack, technically, but we don't- we won't have the manpower for it. One million stack, what am I saying? So the world conquest for Mercuria in uh, 1579, yep. Saw that. Pretty sick shit. That was in a, a patch ago though, when the uh, hordes were even more broken than they are now. Well, I wouldn't exactly say that they're broken. Well, they're stronger than other nations, I suppose. I feel like this is kind of silly. Negative autonomy to change is really shit for, uh, for hordes. Because they don't get autonomy reduction during war and you're kind of always at war. So. Unless you pick up economic ideas, you're kind of fucked. So I, I believe in about a year's time, my truces with either John Poor or Multan are gonna run out. 
you know, full turn. So I reckon I should be getting these guys over there. Oh, well, I have to unseat this first. Maybe I can get these guys from Brunei over there. I suppose I can. Have one walk on foot and the other one uh, bring that one along by ship. Yeah, you could also look at br past broadcasts. Like, I could explain it to you, but it's so weird that uh, you might want to just, you know, see it for yourself. I just woke up, had eight hours of sleep, and I feel like shit. How do you manage with four? Aw, oh, dedication. <laughs> It's funny because a lot of times I'll say on Friday, yo oh, man, I'm totally gonna be streaming early in the morning. But this time I was like, really? Like, oh my god, I'm gonna stream tomorrow morning. I'm gonna fucking stream tomorrow. And I, and I actually did. Quite proud of myself. I even apped my girlfriend today. I was like, hey. If I if I don't uh, respond by tomorrow uh, 8 a.m., could you call me? She was like, okay. And she did! This Admiral has got to go, though. It's kind of useless, and it's costing me military point. And I still really have to finish defensive ideas, so... Well, let's not judge it before it's, uh... Let's not judge the book by its cover. Now, it might end up being a lot better than we think it is. Also, coffee helps out. So, speaking about that, I'm gonna go for a cup. So, I'll see you guys in about in a couple minutes. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're watching this on Twitch, don't go anywhere. I'll be back in about three minutes. So, anyway, thank you for watching. And I'd like to ask you to read that little thingy I've got down below, down below the stream here about Ethiopia. There's a major drought going on and they kind of need our help, so...
If you want to check that out, that's uh, real good. You can either donate using this link here. It's gonna go uh, to the Gaming for Good uh, charity, and you can also talk about it with your friends, family, co-workers, and help raise awareness about the issue, because it's really hard for charity organizations to raise awareness about this, because there's so much other crap going on. So, anyway, thank you, and I'll see you guys in just a bit. Also, that is the entire reason why I'm streaming so early, because I hate early mornings. <laughs> but, you know, that's uh, sacrifices have to be made, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, I'll see you guys in about five minutes. Still a horde in 1677? Yeah, I'm not reforming on purpose, uh, for kicks. Reforming is for uh, weaklings. We don't reform. We stay true to the old ways. Oh. All right, welcome back. Yeah. <laughs> I like how people are counting down. <laughs> that bathrobe, too. Oh man, this bathrobe is the shit. The greatest. I love this bathrobe. Also, I'm not wearing a hat right now. Look at this beautiful plunder that we've stolen from the Western Dogs. <laughs> the Western Dogs. It's so bright in my room, I really need to- I don't know how to fix that. <laughs> like, maybe I can just like, lower the brightness or something? Oh, that's lowering it a bit. Still really bright though. Oh my god, what the fuck's going on here? Alright. Sorry, I'm thinking about doing a Castile Ultimate Achievement Run. World Conquest, any tips? Get ready for a bumpy ride. I trust that the wig is properly powdered. <laughs> ah, it is. What a sunny day. Ah, oh, I'm not in name making right now. Yeah, it is a really sunny day. Also, if it's this early in the day, then the sun really shines into the room, so that's kind of... That kind of adds to the brightness, too. I really do need to uh, locate that and get some more cannons in there, because this is getting to the ridiculous point right now. little bit more cannons over here, and the rest of you idiots can go deal with that. <laughs> Have I ever thought about doing an Aztec World Conquest before? Well, I've thought about it. It'd be uh, really difficult though. 
because North America starts so isolated, so you gotta have to you, you gotta have to wait for a very long time before you can even get to move. Okay. Well, on the plus side, everything uh, everything on the uh, Eurasia Africa is uh, overseas. World conquest is probably not possible as the uh, Aztecs, though. But you can do a world domination. You can. Uh, no feed vassals, sure.